everybody welcome to the weekly vlog yes we're doing a weekly vlog this week so it is monday 8th of april currently reading so the, i'm going to do a weekly vlog but it's going to have reading and coloring in it as well as everything else so i'm currently reading the alperton angels uh, the mysterious case of the alperton angels really good love the way it's written it's written in like notes and emails and text messages whatsapps and so on and pages from books so i like that i like the way it's done it all makes perfect sense so far It'll be interesting to see where it goes for the first time in a long time today i actually have hope a little bit of hope this morning um as you know i believe i told you my mum had a fall a few weeks ago and she, we've had to do everything for her pretty much she's got carers coming in they're trying to get her self-sufficient again but for the first time since that fall, my mum went and made a cup of tea on her own. It may seem so insignificant to everybody, but she hasn't been able to do that because she's been using a walking frame without a tray. Today, she walked to the kitchen, made a cup of tea, took it back into the living room, and it's made me so happy. Um, for, for the first time in a long time, I have some hope that she's going to be okay. We're hoping to take her away on holiday with us in the summer holidays. More on that when we get there i'm hoping she's gonna come i think she will just to give her a break from the house i don't want to leave her on her own but yeah so i'm really happy so we're gonna go and get some milk for her and a few other bits go down and see what she wants for lunch see if she wants any help or if she wants to try and do it on her own i will encourage her to try and do some of it and uh yeah Feels feel a bit happy today, a bit happier today than I've felt in a long time, for obvious reasons. But let's go. It's Monday evening. Not a lot's happened. Um, I finished that. I'm reading that. I'm tired. Ugh. I don't know if I was driving around the wall with a flaming tablet. I want to watch this, I want to watch that. Then something gets put on and she blames me for it. I'm just sick of it. So I'm going to for five minutes breath. I'll be alright. Um, yeah, not a lot to say. Mostly just running around looking after mum. And then... Uh, I don't know anymore. I've got a couple of orders that have come in. I'm going to pack up tomorrow and send them off. But right now I just want to sleep. I am watching a YouTube video um that people have mentioned about marilyn and uh, this is a, a girl who does a lot of tiktoks and apparently there's a lot of mistakes in it so i've thought i'd have a listen to it and see what what actually hap what actually is going on so i'll let you know hey everybody it's actually tuesday afternoon so i'm sorry i haven't vlogged this morning it's been a hell of a night and day um i had a phone call at 10 to 4 this morning from my mum she'd somehow fallen over and couldn't get back up now, <clears throat> the thing is, she wasn't where I would have expected her to be if she was going to or coming from the bathroom. So what happened, I don't know. She's fine. She hasn't hurt herself. Well, she banged her knee, but she's not hurt. And she feels fine. So, of course, 10 to 4, I had to head down to there. I got her back up. Um, uh, made her a cup of tea. She had a cigarette. I made her a hot water bottle. Took her to the toilet, made sure she was alright going to the toilet, and she's been since and she's fine. And then I um, got her back into bed with her hot water bottle and I left. I didn't really sleep then and at all. I, I dozed off around time to get up. And then, of course, I got Jennifer up to school, I'm gonna pick her up in a minute. And then I went straight from school to mum's to see if the care had been, she hadn't. So I made mum a cup of tea, a couple of cups of tea, I had one couple with her waiting for the carer to come just so that the carer was aware of what happened she broke her glasses and everywhere I, I don't know what she did um once the carer had been there and i'd explained what had happened i left them to it because they're good as gold and i went home and i went back to bed until one o'clock i was still shattered because i hadn't slept anyway as you can see the light's funny because it's actually raining but the sun's out it's bizarre weather in wales at the moment and then i went down at one o'clock for lunch, got her something to eat, a couple of cups of tea, moved the big coffee table out of the living room so that if she falls, she's not out, because my big fear is she's going to hurt herself on, on the furniture, now she's got a big space where she can shuffle around much better, 
so I feel a lot better now that that's out of the way. She's still got a small coffee table because when my dad bought them, they're bloody heavy oak things. And she fills it with rubbish, so I've condensed it all down into one small one and put that one out in the um, dining room under the big table for now, under the dining table. I'm going to pick up Jennifer and then I'll talk more later. See you in a bit. Everybody, it is Wednesday the 10th of April. I'm not with it at all. I'm up in the library office bedroom trying to just decide what to do. I've just put a video up that was editing. I'm going to delete all the, the videos now. Clear some space. Cats up here with me. I'll show you now. Hang on. So grooming yourself again in your head. Hey, okay. Steady. She's so sweet. So sweet. So let's look at it. Oh, my lovely colouring books. You see that top shelf there? That is all Jade summer colouring books. And there's even some there. And some on that shelf there in the middle. And some I haven't coloured in my I haven't coloured this yet, pile. So I'm gonna do what I've got to do and i'll be going to mum's later i'll ring her a bit see how she is just to uh see how she's getting on so i'm back at home after sorting out mum this morning doing her lunch and everything she's fine i'm in a bit of a state again uh while i was there her um a very old best friend rang who lives in australia uh, they knew each other years ago they've been friends since school now mum didn't realize who was on the phone so he gave it to me I said hello and she said oh hello love how are you doing I said I'm, I'm fine and then she said how's your mum and dad and I was like oh I said well dad passed away in February she went what I said I'll explain what happened and it turned out it was my mum's friend Anita from Australia so put her onto mum's and then I went to go and do some shopping so I went and did some shopping so that set me off for a bit and then I'm dealing with a company who dad bought a car from there was problems with it they've been they were a bit of a pain, but they're all right now. But we're having trouble getting a, a V5 logbook because when Dad taxed the car, we never got a logbook back. So they're trying to resell it. So then I rang them. They said, oh, don't worry. We've we've applied for a logbook as well. So I said, that's fine. Just ring me on this number if it sells. I mean, my mum don't care if, if she has to write off the money. She she doesn't care anymore. I care. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to keep um, on at them uh, every now and again. But I've just had another crying fit because, because of it. And I feel like crying again now. Oh, so I'm going to watch some YouTube. Because I'm still trying to catch up on the colouring pages for March. I might film a couple of TikToks. I do want to film at some point uh, my reading wrap up, which I have done. My book haul went up today. So, yes. Yeah, Bit much, but at least I don't have to worry about doing the V5 because getting a V5 because the company is sorting it out. So I'm so glad of that there's one less thing I have to do. The only thing I have to do now is get his shares transferred. And if mum ever needs any money, we can cash those in. She's okay, she's doing a lot better than I am. She's grieving him, but he was my best friend, so. <sighs> Anyway, I'm, I'm going to try and film a colour in chat as well. I don't know when that'll be. It was going to be today, but it might not be now, obviously. But I'll uh, I'll see you in a bit. But I am going to uh, go and watch a bit of YouTube because it'll cheer me up seeing people's colouring pages. It always does. Everybody, it is Thursday. We were all shattered last night. Me from running around and not used to it. Jennifer from not sleeping properly over the holidays. She literally was knackered. Um, she didn't want to go to Taekwondo, so she came up to Nanny's with me when I did Danny's tea. And then she, um, 20 past seven, it was like, she was trying, she was falling asleep. She was falling asleep on me. So it's like, come on, Jen, up to bed. So Paul took her up to bed to read to her and she just went to sleep. So, which is great. I, I went up, I tried to read for a bit. I think I read one chapter and I was just tired. It took me a while to get off, but I had really good sleep when I did get off. Hooray! So I felt a lot better this morning. I'm in the spare bedroom at Mum's house, sorting a few bits out and pieces. I've still got a lot of stuff that I had for eBay here, so I'm just having a quick look through it. Might photograph a few. 
it's hard being in this room because all of his clothes are here. I uh, haven't gone through them yet. I will. Um, Because uh, my niece wants some jumpers, so, and I want a jumper as well to cuddle. At the moment, it's just too hard to to look at. So I'll message her say I am starting to get myself ready to do it. <laughs> Chris orders a load of packing stuff for what he needed to take to um New Zealand. Let me just show you. He ordered oh, a bit, bit too much. You know the bubble wrap? That was mine. I brought it down for him to use and he hasn't actually touched it as you can see or he might have used just a tiny little bit. Um, but this is packing peanuts that he, he ordered. Excuse that. I don't know why that's there. Let's move that out of the way. Um, and these are all the boxes. These are all over their massive boxes now. They're really sturdy so we're not going to throw them away. We'll leave them here for now because uh, if any of us ever need to move they're really good stack it they're really good sturdy boxes for things um but these, look at this big pack of packing peanuts now these actually dissolve in water so they they're biodegradable they defo so literally they just fall apart in water and disappear so I, i'll have those at some point i once i've sorted my shed out because it's a bit of a mess that bubble wrap will be going back up as you can see there's some tape as well there that he said i could have he said i could have all this um, obviously, I wouldn't use the big boxes because I don't sell send things of that size. But what I would do is is use it if I was moving. So, but these packing peanuts might come in handy when I'm selling cameras and things. So, I, I'm trying to sort the shed out and and tidy it up and throw stuff away. It's just very short, and uh, I will use those. But I'm going to crack on because it's nearly lunchtime, and I want to get Mum's lunch so I can actually go home and I got to wash up as well. Everyone. It's actually Friday afternoon. I'm just sitting outside in the garden. It's quite nice out here today. It's quite warm. And I'm just sitting here because I went in the shed for something and Zed's in the shed. So, Zed, come out the shed, please. Zeddy. Don't want to be shutting her in there again, you see. It's a nice day. It's quite warm. I'll go down and get Jen soon. But yeah, like last night we just fell asleep on the sofa. Then I woke up, went down, did mum's tea. We had some dinner and then we went to bed. We were all shattered. So, but yeah, not too bad today. Mum's fine. So the Hearing Wales people came today. And they come again on the 24th. They can't actually do the test because their ears are impacted with very hard wax, which is why she can't hear anything. <laughs> now she does, she is deaf anyway. So even with the wax in the ear, it's it's just making it worse. So they're going to come again on the, on the 24th and syringe it out, get cleaner ears out, and then they'll do the hearing test to see how bad her hearing actually is. Because obviously, with the wax blocking it, there might be a little bit of... She might have a little bit of uh, hearing there, but it wouldn't be making it worse. So, oh, yeah. So they're coming again to do it, so... So I'm just sitting here in the warm. I'm going to go in in a minute if the cat ever gets out of the shed. Sort out what I've got to do and go and get Jen. So see what happens later. I've just been to the shop to drop off a parcel and to get a loaf of bread because I'm out. Um, also went to the chemist to pick up mum's prescription, get her some paracetamol. So I've done that. Um, and I'm waiting for Jen, so that's okay. Not a major problem, she won't be long. It's very hot in the car. I've got the door open. I've got the windows open. I'm melting. I've got a fleece on because um, it was colder earlier. And I plan to go and sit in the garden when I get home until I go and get Mum's dinner. Uh, her dinner will be from the chip shop. She has fish cake and chips. She loves it. So get her that. And while she's eating that, I just um, get everything ready for the evening, like hot water bottle and stuff like that. Before I go home, and then we have our dinner outside because it's so lovely today. We might as well enjoy it. So, my vlogging camera, they will be able to fix it, it's going to cost me £210, um, needs a new lens barrel, which is fine, I'm going to get a case to put it in so that it doesn't get so dusty and damaged, so, and I'll keep it safe. But yeah, so I'm just waiting on a call now that it's ready and I can go pick it up from Cardiff, it be fun, I have to go in on the train or, but I'll have to do it at some point. And yeah, just going to poodle on and wait for Jen. Friday night, me and Jennifer have just had showers, haven't we? Dried our hair. Showing the pictures that I made. Oh, Jennifer made a picture. And 
Look, this is the um, Marilyn thing up on the, the shelf, the bus. Hang on a minute, see what she's done. Who's that? Granddad. Oh, is this Granddad? Yeah. Oh, baby. I, I wanted the one, and just in case you don't remember him. Oh, that is so sweet. I'll never forget him, but I will treasure that forever. Um, I need to wipe the name, but I don't know how to wipe it. What, Granddad? Yeah. Okay, so I'll tell you, it's G. Rest on the okay. book, darling. R A N D D A D He liked apples, did Grandad, didn't he? He liked his fruit. Oh, is that what they Oh, brilliant. It's very good, Jen. And she's wearing the pyjamas he got over Christmas. I did a pattern. Yeah. Thank you. That's a sweet, sweet picture. I will keep that forever. I'll treasure that. So, are you going to keep drawing or do you want to watch on your tablet? I will in a bit. Yeah, I'll find some stuff to stick it up with. You didn't use my pin. I don't think they'd go in the wall, sweetie. What I'll do is I'll get some blue tack from somewhere. There's some in Daddy's, well, in the spare room where Daddy's having a sleep. There it is, but I'll get some fresh. All right, are you going to watch on your tablet for a bit or are you going to keep drawing? All right, okay. Wait, are you going to sleep? No, I'm going to read. I'm not my Jen. Yeah. And Jennifer's got a new pair of trainers. It's that day. Should afternoon. I show you? And they've got Sonic the Hedgehog on them. Let me show you them properly. Look at those. They are Sonic. Absolutely brilliant. We also went in the charity shop, a uh, new charity shop, PDSA one. And she got Glow Magic World of Wonder. And I got books, obviously, because I always buy books, don't I, Paul? Aren't I naughty? Right, should we go see Nanny Sally? Yay! And the dogs? Yay! Where are you? She got... Where are you? She got two dogs. Oh, I'm facing um, the wrong way. We're going to go see Coco and Shadow the dogs, aren't we? Yes. And Nanny Sally. What kind of dogs are they? Um, sausage dogs. Sausage. They're Dachshunds. Yeah. Dachshunds. Right, let's go then. Let's go see Nanny Sally. Go. What are you doing, baby? Are you being fancy? Oh, it's there somewhere. It is Sunday morning. Hello, Jen. We're at the boot sale. Very small, but got some good stuff, didn't we? <laughs> yeah, she's showing off again. You can't see yourself. It's really dark, darling, oh. because of the sun. A beautiful day. We're going to go play in the park in a bit, aren't we? Before we go shopping. Yeah. Going to have my bacon sandwich now. In the park before we go do our, our food shopping, isn't it, Paul? Yes, dear. Last time I came in here was with Grandad. There's always something there to remind me. I don't know, can't sing the tune, but there is. But she's so beautiful. She's having fun. That's all that matters. Got some nice books at the boot sale. Some for me, some for Jen. I'm well happy. It is Sunday night. Jennifer's in bed because the tooth fairy's coming tonight because she lost a tooth today. It's her second one. Oh, the baby's growing up so fast, isn't she? Um, we just had a shower and I've dried her hair and... She's all nice and clean, and so am I. I'm going to put some cream on my face in a minute because it's a bit dry. And I'm just lying in bed reading this. It's really good. I'm enjoying it. It's YA, but, you know, it's easy. It's nice to read. Um, according to Jennifer, I need more books because I like books. I've got a little spot there, as you can see. Um, but I, I think for now I'm all, I'm all right. I think I'm okay. I'm trying to read the stack by my bed. Includes War and Peace. I'll be reading a bit of that in a bit, but I want to try and, and get through this. So I'm just curled up in bed. Paul's watching TV, and I'm just reading for a bit. It's nice. Mum's fine. Ugh, I'm tired, but Mum's fine. Just peace and quiet. And have a nice, easy night before we do Monday again. But that's about it for the, the vlog this week. It's a bit, been a bit hit and miss, so I'll try it again next week. I'm trying to do more reading and colouring updates, so, yeah. 
See you later.